The federal government is poised to announce a fresh cost of living package as the Prime Minister Anthony Albanese recalls Labor MPs to Canberra for a caucus meeting. But it's hosing down speculation that the government is preparing to rework the Stage 3 tax cuts that are due to come into effect on July 1 this year. Olivia Caisley has more from Canberra. The Prime Minister has tasked Treasury with coming up with some ways that relief could be delivered without exacerbating inflation. It's a wicked problem for the government that's going to require a nifty solution. If we can find ways to put extra dollars in people's pockets, particularly those low and middle income earners who are doing it tough, yeah. then we're prepared to do so. Caucus will tick off on the response on Wednesday in a special meeting that's happening before the parliamentary year begins in earnest. That in-person discussion involves bringing Labor MPs back to Canberra two weeks early. They have faced some criticism for the cost of that exercise. It's about half a million dollars to bring the Labor caucus to Canberra, the airfares, and overnight um, what's called travel allowance for people staying overnight on Wednesday night. The main reason for that seems to be so they can go to a party. So Australians, I think, would reasonably have some questions about the cost of this exercise. Labor says it's a prime example of the opposition being negative. There is also some speculation that Cabinet will be presented with potential tweaks to the government's Stage 3 tax cut policy. Nine Media is reporting possible changes could include increasing the tax-free threshold but keeping the top marginal rate at $180,000, meaning that cohort would get less than promised. It's a measure that's due to come into effect in the middle of this year but has been a contentious piece of policy due to fears it'll exacerbate inflation. We would absolutely need to see the detail, but it is a backflip on the election commitment that the Prime Minister made to the people. Can you confirm, just regarding tax cuts, um, can you confirm tax cuts as legislated will come into effect on July 1st? Uh, I can confirm that we haven't changed our position.